Sarah, I don't know what reaction you want, but can this be it so we can be done? All right. So maybe it's still you. Someone needed to do something. I mean, you went wading into a well of sorrows. Who hears that and thinks, well, Dunker Butt, let's have a go. I mean, that whole place, clearly demon bait. Top to bottom. It makes messing with their relics real stupid. So, test done, you're still you. We can leave these lies behind. So your main takeaway is that elves worship demons? Well, they never call them that, yeah. But that's what it had to be. I mean, it was impressive and all. Makes the Dalish look like tits for living in the woods, but so what? There can't be a bunch of gods and the Maker. Don't matter how much or little you believe, those don't fit. So call me stupid, but I believe the stuff not made up by dead people who failed. Mithal is a ruin full of demons. I mean, it just makes sense, right? That's the legacy of our people you're insulting. And? And I'm Dalish and might take exception. Why believe it? Because Abelas looked weird. If that's all it takes, Karifi's shit heel is full of lumpy truth. I get it. You're an elf. Be all elfy. But this? You're the frigging herald of Andraste. Every time you open your mouth, you'll sound like an idiot. It's not as if it matters what I believe. I've already denied being the herald. Not for me to say, yeah. Just saying. Anyway, believe what you want. So long as we kill Karifi fish. Whatever. Corypheus died, and then he didn't. That's why he always felt wrong, like he didn't fit inside himself. He wears another man's life. I thought dying was forever. So did I. Corypheus seems to break a lot of rules. Is it him? Is he real? If a man can be dead and then not... Could I have saved the real Cole? Corypheus is using his connection to the Blight to make himself immortal. You couldn't do that. It gnawed at me, hooks in the hollows, pain of not knowing like the knot in his belly. But that is a hurt, and hurts can heal. I can heal. Forget. Cole? Cole? Are you? You may still use that name, if you like. I am here to help you. Victory in the Arbor Wilds. Real threat to our army, but it flew off once we turned the tide. It is still out there, however. I wonder what Corypheus plans now. We'll deal with whatever he throws at us. Do not underestimate Corypheus. He is powerful, and you have yet to fight him one on one. But he will come. You will get your chance. If he tries, he'll regret it. I believe you. Not long ago, this was impossible to imagine. You, 
Successful against all odds. Victory close at hand. The time has come to consider what will come next. Oh, I have plans of my own. As you should. Blessed are they who stand before the corrupt and the wicked and do not falter. I will stand with you in the end, Inquisitor, if you will have me. Though all before me is shadow, yet shall the Maker be my guide. I shall not be left to wander the drifting roads of the beyond. For there is no darkness in the Maker's light, and nothing that he has wrought shall be lost. A prayer for you? For those we have lost, and those I am afraid to lose. How can you still have faith? I've questioned it at times. I found comfort in faith when life offered little. Corypheus will retaliate. It's only a matter of time. We must draw strength wherever we can. Unless he gets bored and surrenders. Any chance of that? <laughs> I doubt it. Inquisitor, thank the Maker you're here. Morrigan chased after her son into the Illuvian. She was terrified. She was chasing Kirin? She said he activated the mirror somehow, and then she ran into it. I don't think she expected this. You must go after her. I will find help, Inquisitor. Crossroads? This is the Fade. How did the Alluvian lead here? Could it go anywhere? Morrigan! Go back. I must find Kieran before it's too late. Why would Kieran do this? How could he do this? We stand in the Fade. To direct the Illuvian here would require immense power. If he is lost to me now, after all I have sacrificed... Rather convenient this happened just as I needed to speak with you. <laughs> yes. 
cleverly lure you into the fade. My master stroke. You drank from the well, Inquisitor. What do the voices tell you now? Nothing. They're completely silent. Whatever happens to him now, it is my doing. I set him on this path. Please, help me look, Inquisitor. Just a little longer. this a surprise? Clearly not the good sort of surprise. My lovely Morrigan has a flair for the dramatic. Thankfully, my grandson is more sensible. Kirin is not your grandson. Let him go. As if I were holding the boy hostage. She's always been ungrateful, you see. Ungrateful? I know how you plan to extend your life, wicked crone. You will not have me, and you will not have my son! Oh, be a good lad, and restrain her. What are you doing? What are you doing? I don't know. Of course you know. You drank from the well, did you not? <gasps> you... Armathal. Well, that was unexpected. You, of all people, should expect the unexpected by now. I'm sorry, Mother. I heard her calling to me. She said now was the time. I do not understand. Once I was but a woman. Crying out in the lonely darkness for justice. And she came to me, a wisp of an ancient being, and she granted me all I wanted and more. I have carried Mythal through the ages ever since, seeking the justice denied to her. Then... You carry Mythal inside you? She is a part of me. No more separate than your heart from your chest. What do the voices tell you? They say you speak the truth. But what was Mythal? A legend given name and called a god? Or something more? Truth is not the end, but a beginning. So young and vibrant, you do the people proud and have come far. As for me, I have had many names, but you may call me Flemeth. If Mythal is a part of you, why haven't you helped us? We've called to you, prayed to you. What was could not be changed. What about now? You know so much. You know not what you ask, child. Why did Mithal come to you? For a reckoning that will shake the very heavens. And you follow her whims? 
Do you even know what she truly is? You seek to preserve the powers that were, but to what end? It is because I taught you, girl. Because things happened that were never meant to happen. She was betrayed as I was betrayed, as the world was betrayed. Mythal clawed and crawled her way through the ages to me, and I will see her avenged! Alas, so long as the music plays, we dance. So you lured us here. What do you want? One thing, and one thing only. I have to go now, Mother. No. I will not allow it. He carries a piece of what once was, snatched from the jaws of darkness. You know this. He is not your pawn, Mother. I will not let you use him. Have you not used him? Was that not your purpose, the reason you agreed to his creation? That was them. Now he... He is my son. Flemeth extends her life by daughters, Inquisitor. That was the fate she intended for me. I thwarted her, and now she intends to have Kieran instead. You're going to steal the body of a young boy? If my daughter believes it, then it must be so. Kieran, I... As you wish, hear my proposal, dear girl. Let me take the land, and you are free of me forever. I will never interfere with or harm you again. Or keep the lad with you, and you will never be safe from me. I will have my due. He returns with me. Decided so quickly. Do whatever you wish. Take over my body now if you must, but Kieran will be free of your clutches. I am many things, but I will not be the mother you were to me. Dreams? No more dreams. A soul is not forced upon the unwilling, Morrigan. You were never in danger from me. As for you, Inquisitor, there is an ancient altar deep within a shaded wood. Go to it. Summon the dragon that is its guardian. Master it in combat? And it is yours to command against Corypheus. Fail and die. Wait! Are you all right, Kieran? You are not hurt. I feel lonely.
She wanted the old god soul all along. Is it worth reminding myself that perhaps I do not know everything after all? My mother has the soul of an elven goddess, or whatever Mithal truly was, and her plans are unknown to me. So what happens now? Mother said, you must summon a dragon at an ancient altar. Do you know where that is? I think so. It's a place dedicated to Mithal. As, no doubt, is the guardian you must battle. Pray my mother has not led you astray, Inquisitor. She is not above doing so for her own amusement. It's here. I can feel it. Are you certain it's still in one piece? I'm sure it's here. Just keep an eye out. There it is. This is all that's left of the altar. We few who travel far, call to me and I will come. Without mercy, without fear. I'm here, Flemeth, just as you told me. If I must master a dragon to fight Corypheus, then send it.
believed it. It will come when I summon it. Once. That's enough to fight Corypheus, however. I have my dragon. All you need now is Corypheus and BAM! Dragon fight! What can I do for you, Inquisitor? Questions, questions. 